What's going on? My name's Danny Dela Cruz, and I'm here at the Marshall Studios checking out the new Marshall Studio JTM. I've not really had to do much to it to get a good sound out of it, to be honest. And that goes for all those classic Marshall uh, remakes, reissues, and just classic Marshalls in general. It's definitely familiar territory to some of the Marshalls that I personally own. I've got 100 watt Plexi, and that's the hand wide 59. Um, and I'm used to running that with just a boost pedal. Don't really need more than that for a lead tone. And that's actually what we're doing today. We've got a blues breaker in the front if I want to do some lead sounds and all the rhythms are just the amp on its own. Um, and I think that's the beautiful thing about this amp. It's a great platform for other pedals and drive pedals especially. But at the same time, if you want to just plug straight in, you're going to get a great sound. <laughs> I really like the look of this amp, to be honest. I'm a sucker for like classy looking cream things anyway, you know, and my girlfriend was eyeing this up earlier, saying this would look good in the, uh, the living room. So that's always a bonus. I'm allowed to play in the living room now. <laughs> All the things that I was playing today was just improvised on the spot. Um, and I think that's always a good sign of a good bit of gear. You know, if you're playing something for the first time and you're influenced to and inspired to play new things on the spot and improvise, that's normally a good sign of this thing rocks, you know. Yeah. 